Just pull yourself up, man. You can do this. You can do this. No. I'm gonna die. Welcome back to the world of the long dark. And as you can see, it is bright and early in the morning. And the plan I have for this episode, I do see a wolf. But you know what? We're not going to let him ruin our day. All right. I'm just going to ignore him and head to the plan. So the plan is we're going to go on that hiking trail that we encountered on the last one. I didn't go on it at all. So I feel like we should check it out. Before we do that, though, I'm going to eat an energy bar for breakfast. And I guess I'll see you out on the trail. I hope you've brought your hiking boots because we're at the trail now. I did hear a wolf not too long ago off in that direction, so I think we better start now. I don't know how long the hike's going to be or how high up we're going to go, but I guess we'll find out. There's a building right here. I don't know what it is. If it's a... Oh, yeah, it's like a, one of those hiking signs. Apparently, we're at the Milton Park. The sign doesn't say too much of anything or anything at all. Does it just post-it notes? I do see some birds circling above, so... There's something dead further down on the trail, so I mean, we're going to find out. It also seems to be a building we can enter, which is awesome. So I guess we'll find out. It's probably a dead guy, seeing as it's right next to the building. So that may be good. He may have a rifle or something like that. That would be ideal. I'm also going to take some sticks because if this is a long hike, we may need to start a fire eventually if it gets too cold but i don't know we'll see oh yep that's definitely a dude that's good though we can start a fire here so we may not have to build a campfire if it gets too cold but we are getting warmed up in this building so we may not need to do that Ooh, a flare shell i will leave that there and remember if we ever get that distress pistol firearm cleaning kit okay so there may be a firearm here let's see if this guy has it nope Nothing. He is useless. Sorry, I didn't mean to... That, that was disrespectful. You'd think if he has a firearm cleaning kit, there may be a rifle come in somewhere. Painkillers is not what I need right now. Ketchup chips, you know what? That is something I need, so I'll take it. We're also feeling a little tired. The journey over here did kind of take some energy out of us. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to drink one of these. This is a Go Energy drink, and apparently it provides a boost to stamina, reduces fatigue, and it's good for extra energy when in tough spots, but distracting headaches may follow. You know what? We've been attacked by so many wolves. I think we can handle a headache, so I'll just drink it for the energy. I don't know exactly. Oh, wow. Fatigue has been reduced. I'm feeling buzzed. Do you see this? We got some electric vibe going on. So, I mean, that's good. We are now rejuvenated and ready to complete this hike. We may have reached the top already because it says climbing area, which worries me. I don't know what I'm going to have to climb, but... Oh, yeah, maybe up here. I see a mountaineering rope on that rock. I don't know. I haven't climbed anything yet. I, I'm not aware of my climbing abilities, so... I think it does take energy, so you know what? We may do that now before the energy drink wears off, so... Yep, this is definitely a climbing area. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't know. Do we have any reason to climb over there, though? That's the thing. I don't know. We have a lot of energy, so we might as well. You know what? Let's do it. I'm feeling adventurous, okay? I'm a little worried, though. Oh, wow. It does reduce your tiredness pretty quick. It's a good thing we drank that energy drink because, I mean, that wasn't too bad, honestly. Like I said, though, I don't know if there's anything down there. It doesn't seem like there's too much of anything. Look at all those mountains, man. I don't know if we're ever going to have to go down there, though. But I'm wondering, what's on this little cliff edge that we're on right now? I see a sign. Oh, just this climbing area. So I'm guessing we can climb something else. There's a bunny right there. And you know what? I could use the food. Oh, he's so peaceful. I have to do it. And I did realize you can actually aim. So... I think that's good. Yes, we got him. I feel bad, though. That bunny was just chilling. He wasn't even worried about me. But it turns out he should have been because he is a dead bunny now. We'll cook him up later when we get to the house. And you know what? I'll leave his friend alone. So, that's fine. I do hear some wolves, though. I have no idea where we're going. Oh, wow. We are running low on energy pretty damn quick. 
Fatigue reduced. Oh, shit. You know what? Oh, and I see a wolf up there. You know what? This could be bad. Uh, because if we are low on energy, I'm pretty sure we can't climb. So, we better have enough energy to climb this rope or we're going to be uh, screwed. Okay, we're going to climb it now. Seems to take a lot of energy. I don't know if we're going to be able to do it. I hope we can. I do not want to fall off right now. Oh, shit. What's that at the right? What is that? This may be bad. If that runs out, I'm pretty sure we're going to fall. And okay, we got a sprain wrist going on. We're carrying too much. This is not good. Come on, man. I do not want to die this way. Dude, you have like two seconds left. Come on, don't do this. We're dead. We're dead. There's no way we're dying like this. Come on, please. Please, dude. Just pull yourself up, man. It's not that hard. Okay, I shouldn't be talking. Just pull yourself up, man. You can do this. You can do this. No. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, man. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, shit. Yeah, this is the end. Please tell me we're not going to die like this. Please. You were so close to the top. Oh, my God, dude. This is not good. Please, come on. Please. I'm going to lose it. Just crawl up. You can do this, man. I'm not going to go down like this. Literally and figuratively. Oh, my God. I think we made it. Okay. Holy shit. Feeling so drained. Dude. <laughs> Dude, I'm losing it, man. That was so bad. Holy shit. Wow. Okay, we're gonna have to sleep in this little shed. And I'm not gonna complain, believe me, dude. I thought we were gonna die there. My life flashed before my eyes. And it was, yeah, wow. Honestly, I don't care that I'm gonna have to sleep next to this dead guy. Because, yeah, that, you know, let's just take a nap. It's kind of dawning on me that we're not gonna make it home, okay? By the time we get there, the sun will already have been set. And... Yeah, I do not want to be out here at night, so... Alright, come on. Let's not bitch about these small things, okay? You almost died. But yeah, I'm gonna have to spend the night in this building, which worries me a little bit. As you can see, there's no door, so a wolf can just stroll on in. So, uh, yeah, let's just hope that doesn't happen. In the meantime, though, we are hungry, so you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna try and start a fire. I'm just gonna use our accelerant, because this is one of those emergency situations, so I'm just gonna use it. Luckily, we got the... Luckily, we... Luckily, we... Luckily, we got this bunny during the hike because I do need food. So, I guess we'll just gut him and cook him on the stove. And you know what? The fire's actually not going to last too long. So, let's go out there, get some sticks. And, <laughs> dude, I'm telling you, I'm still recovering from that whole hiking situation back there. That was... That was brutal. Yeah, it was... That was an awful situation. I was sure we were going to die just then. And, yeah, I'm just... I'm just happy we made it out. I'm a little traumatized, not gonna lie, but you know what? I can deal with it. Dude, I did not want to die like that. That would have been the worst way to go out. We would have broken every bone in our body. We would have slipped off the cliff and had a, yeah, a bad death. I, if I want to die, I want to at least die valiantly, attacking a wolf, you know, sa trying to save my life. Arguably, falling off a cliff would probably not be as painful, but you know what? My pride would be hurt, okay? And my pride is important. Yummy rabbit, okay? Probably won't fill us up too much. I mean, it's better than nothing, I guess. But I think we have another piece of rabbit that we can cook, actually. Yeah. Plop them on there. I am a little worried about spending the night in this building, but like I said, we have to do it. We have no other choice. And yeah, we have a radio here. Let's see if it doesn't work. Okay. I don't know if there's any wolves that climb this high on the mountain, but... Let's just hope that isn't the case, all right? Oh, damn. Turns out the rabbit is cold. But you know what? I'm not going to complain. I almost died back there. All right, let's just eat it. If, if we have to eat a cold rabbit, you know, let's get over it. Okay, we could be dead. We could have slipped right off this mountain. I'm just trying to check to see how far the drop would be. Oh, my God. Yeah, that, that would have definitely been our death. Especially if we fell down, hit that ledge, and slipped even further off the mountain. It would have uh, not been good. Let's be real, okay? Damn. That was pretty traumatizing. I don't think I'm ever going to do that again unless I am assured I have the energy. It's getting pretty damn late, though. So, I don't know exactly what to expect out here at night, but we're... 
Jeez, dude, I hate when he cuts me off. It is spooky out right now. I don't hear any wolves. I haven't heard any howling for a while, so I think we're good. And I mean, we might as well just head to bed, okay? Surprisingly though, nothing happened. Didn't hear anything during the night, slept through it completely fine. I'm just gonna take these two sodas because we are now out of sodas. I had to drink quite a few just to get my thirst up, but yeah, not too bad. We are running low on food, so I'm gonna have to swing by the gas station real quick just to get some more. And I don't know what to think, man, after that whole hiking situation back there. I mean, that was the whole plan to go on this nice, enjoyable hike. And we ended up getting traumatized. So much for an enjoyable hike, you know, but it did teach me not to take anything for granted, okay? We could have died back there. Everything would have been over. And yeah, you know what? Let's just get into the gas station and get some food. It is kind of dark in here, but we do have some matches to spare, so... I'm completely fine using them for this, but I actually don't see too much food, sadly. Oh wait, we got some ketchup chips and some more beef jerky, just in time for the flare to go out. It's not a flare, it's a match, idiot. I'm telling you, man, after that whole experience, everything is just way more beautiful to me. Oh, besides that, that is not beautiful, where is he? Okay, there he is. Uh, I guess we just go inside a house, wait a little bit, and everything will be fine. Okay? Everything will be fine. I guess never mind. That wolf just humbled me. Maybe not everything is beautiful in this world. We still have to be on alert. And, uh, yeah. Let's just hope the wolf's gone now. I don't know. I'm just not gonna go that way. Okay, we're just gonna cut through the woods. Which worries me, because you'd think there'd be more wolves around the woods. But I've taken this route a few times, not having too many problems with it, so... That's fine. I also realized you can harvest these cattail plants and I have a feeling they're tough, not very filling, but edible. Oh, so it's food. And the cattail head can be used as tinder, nice. Seems to be a few cattails over here too, so that's good. But yeah, it's definitely our cue to leave. Seems to be a small wolf pack in the town somewhere. And once again, we have not found a gun, but I will check up on our maple saplings to see if they're cured yet. Because I'm telling you, man, I want to build a bow. Home sweet home. It does feel good to be back here. I mean, we've spent a full day away from the house. And I'm just happy to be back. Alive and well. With all of our bones intact. Not broken. Enemy spotted. I do see a bunny, so you know what that means. We have to take him out, okay? I need some more food. And, uh, yeah. He'll be the food source for today. I'm very happy, though, that I figured out that you can aim... I mean, it didn't help just then, but you get the point. We can aim now. No way. That was some expert aiming there. Nothing like a cooked rabbit down the gullet. I'll just eat it right now. Of course, the rabbits don't feed you too much, but yeah, I'm just happy you got some food in me because we are running pretty damn low on food, so I'll take whatever I can get. And let's check out these saplings. All right, 39% cure. That's pretty good. They're at least progressing. So within the next few days, we will have a bow. It is still midday right now, but you know what? We've been through enough, okay? I'm gonna take the entire day off. We're just gonna relax and uh, yeah, just reflect on that very close call back there. I mean, that was definitely our closest call by far. We almost slipped off, broke, like I said, every bone in our body. That would have been awful. And uh, I mean, even if we survived and broke a leg, we probably would have been munched on by a wolf. Having a broken leg, in these harsh conditions just doesn't sound too pleasant. I hope you enjoyed this very brutal episode of The Long Dark. Yeah, I'm definitely not going to do any more climbing in the next one, but no matter what, we're probably going to have to do some eventually. But you know what? Let's not even think about that. Let's just savor these moments. But in the meantime, I hope you have a good one. See ya.